Hello everyone, I'm back with another video and in today's video we have a mini PC. This is a mini PC Dell Optiplex 3080 model. It comes with an ICO 5 10 gen CPU and in this video I'm gonna go over how you can upgrade this uh, mini PC and how you can find out the max capacity that you can have in here. I made a really short video to see what's your max capacity without installing any programs or anything to see. We have upgraded this uh, PCs up to 32 gig RAM with no issues at all. And in this video, I'm just going to cover up how you can upgrade, remove or replace your RAMs. Almost there is no tools required. All you need to do is your RAM, which are DDR4 RAMs. Uh, SD RAM, I'll leave the link for a good uh, compatible ones in the video description. So first thing first, you want to loosen up the screw back here. So make sure it's just dangling, loose up. Grab the top cover and push it towards the front. You want to see this gap opening about one centimeter. Then you want to pull up the cover upward and put it to one side. Next, you want to see, remove this caddy right in here. You don't actually have to remove it. Let's just leave it there. If you have a hard drive, leave it there. We want to remove this cover right in here. Before we do that, uh, sometimes you need to loosen up this cable for the speaker. So. Bring it upward, untangle it from here. Make sure it's not tangled right through there. Just bring it to forward. Now, punch these two together and then lift up the fan system. And put the fan system to one side. And right on the net, you're gonna see two RAM dims available right there. So kind of dusty. All right, to remove the RAM, it's really, really simple. All you need to do is to put your fingers on the triggers on the side. These triggers, I can't put my finger right there, it's like a one on each side. So when I put these triggers pushed away, the ramp should come out in 45 degree angle, just like that. And all you need to do is to just pull it backward, and there we have it. So it is an 8 gig, so you can put a 16 gig RAM on the bottom and 16 gig on the second slot. Just make sure the RAM is uh, notch right there, matches the notch right on the dim. So if you try to put it that way around, it will not go through. So grab it like this, bring it down in 45 degree, right inside the jack, make sure all the way in. And then you just simply want to push it towards the motherboard and you want to hear these triggers open and close. Just like that. If the triggers only stays open, that means you didn't push it all the way in. If they push away and come over, that means it's in the right place. The second dim, it goes the same way. Let's say I just have a 4 gig lying around. If I want to push it in, I'll put in the second one all the way towards the jack and then push it towards the next ramp and the triggers will close. To remove again, pull these two triggers away and pull out the ramp. And the next thing is to just grab the fan system. Make sure you put the front end of the fan all the way under this metal cover. So, and just push down and make sure it just goes snugly right in there and then grab this cable and tangle it back right over this hinge right there and that should be all for today's video i hope you guys like this video and helped you guys out if it did click that like and subscribe to support the channel if you have any question or requests feel free to leave them in a video comment and i'll try to answer them as soon as i can thanks for watching and i'll see you guys in my next video